Mission 5, Red Bank Rotation. Welcome to Red Bank Carriage Sidings. A rake of coaches have been made ready to serve this, and he hauling to Manchester Victoria Station. So, hey guys, and welcome to the last episode of Devtail Games Trains and Worlds uh, Northern Trans Pennine. So, uh, yeah, this is it. This is mission 5 of 5. We'll be taking the uh, class 47, which is the uh, nicer train of the um, big boys here. And, uh, yeah, I'm never saying that word again. <laughs> And um, yeah, like I said, get ourselves ready to go. Should be a interesting one this, although quite a sad one as well, since we won't be uh, doing any missions here. Although of course we will do some live streams and whatnot in the future. But anyways, let's get ourselves going. Let's get ourselves onto the mission. So stop in Manchester, Victoria. Here at 900 yards, which should be ahead of us. And then um, see what we've got to do from there. It's only a 20 minute long mission this actually, being the finale. My guess is taking this to the station and then switching sides. So yeah, that's a brake wagon will be going in the back. So it may be just a like a switch mission for a finale. Anyhow, let us uh, get ourselves to the main depot. We've got a red signal coming up in 200 meters, so we will stop for that before we um, carry on with our journey today. Mic stands a little bit loose right now, may go that later. Anyhow, that's not part of the train today. Throttle is off and braking. Actually, when you straight brake, we shall use driver brake. Let's bring the train to eight halts just short of the station. Then let's use the map to kind of figure out what's blocking our path. Why can't we get going just yet? You're departing. Yeah, you're the party in crossings our track, because yeah, it's not a bridge as the uh, thing would make it seem. That there is a uh, <clears throat> level crossing there. So once you've departed the track for us, we'll then become free to uh, cross over through. Yeah, Manchester Victoria Station seeing uh, quite a massive redevelopment in the last, I think it's like five, ten years now actually. Um, <clears throat> with the construction of the Manchester Arena, now on top of the station, looks nothing like uh, what it does in the game. So it definitely must have taken a fair bit of time for the Devtel game team to actually like recreate it back in what essentially was its former glory, if you can really call it glory. Right, so, next it will be yellow, which is just after our stop point, which means after that will be red, and my guess, like I said, will probably just be a switching sides mission. little fast so we'll slow down slightly going downhill 0.7% gradient so that will take into account why we are going so fast right so platform we are taking is the one on the left. Will there be any platform markers? Or we're just being told to uh, stop here. Yeah, I believe we're just being told to stop here right now. So, throttles off. Initial application. Release the brakes. Just let the train roll for a little bit. And then, now we will max brake it. That will do. Right, jets complete. Uh, uncoupled coaches. Yeah, it's going down the route I thought it would. Uh, we'll use this side actually. using it onto the track. All clear. Just now decouple you. Probably than worth uh, opening doors actually, but uh, obviously not. Let's now climb back aboard. And let's just go bring the train to the other side. So stop location, just outside the station. Release the brakes. I actually release all the pressure as well to go with it. Because I remember from last week, the uh, brake leftover pressure does seem to cause your entire train to slow down. Your slippage should also not be as much of an issue on the 47. 
this being uh, actually a decent train. Uh, start slowing down actually because there is you right ahead of us staring at us right now. Uh, a little bit shallow actually we've stopped there but we will power him. Kind of just roll to our stop points. There we go. Max braking. Request to proceed at restricted speeds. Braking down to zero again, and throttle goes up. Couple to formation outside this train. Why aren't we going? I'll uh, try that again. So throttle off, brakes have been released, throttle up, power in, there we go. And I presume that you are the outside service train. Yes, you are. So in the moment, we'll get ready to flick the straight brake. The moment we connect onto that, at least the moment we hit the buffers, as that will symbolise a strong connection. There we go. Clear and clear. Couple the train together. Climb back aboard. And I get shut down the cab to, to go to the other side. So you come off, your throttle off, your brake will be neutral shutdown. Reverser off, turn the key. Uh, set the handbrake to release. Oh, hang on, uh, maybe we should put the brakes on, just for the fact that we are now rolling backwards. Climb aboard, give the uh, handle a twist. Not a very good handbrake, actually, if we are rolling with it, must say. A very weak handbrake on the 47. Rubbish train. <laughs> uh, right, um, so yeah, you now go to usual shutdown. And we're now going to be very quick, because if you start rolling again, you will not be able to get back on board. There we go, turn our key on. Reverse to forwards. And brakes to full service. So go for the driver brake test. There we go. Now move to initial application. And in a moment, the part when permitted. Uh, so again, that'll be when the uh, signal turns green. When someone has moved out of the way, that will be you this time. There you go, signal. Yeah. It's left hand side, right? <laughs> What's stopping us from uh, going this time? Where am I? There we go. Yeah, that signal looks pretty green to me. Although, maybe it's not our signal. Hmm, apparently it is. Proceed at restricted speed. Okay, so we are clear to go anyway. Throttle up. Release the brakes. Actually, reset the throttle just in case. And there we go. Power goes in. And we should be clear to go. Signal's green anyway. So that is us covered. Ah, the red signal might have actually been facing the other direction, which is why it uh, wasn't resetting for us yet, because we've just been heading in the um, reverse direction, as to why it was still worth showing that knowledge. So, we're taking uh, these locos to the siding. And I presume we'll be taking this loco then back to Victoria, ready to allow that train to pair in the part. Makes sense, does make sense. So we'll be taking a left turn now, as opposed to straight. Is this servers only a siding or do some lines extend? Yeah, some trains do go on, which would make me presume that heading up north. Maybe the line to Leicester from Victoria? Possibly? What's the line that heads to Leicester from Manchester? Is it from Victoria? Is it from um, Manchester Central? I think Leicester may actually be Central. It may be an East West Coast mainline train. There 
There you go, 101. Now leave in sidings. Where are you going to? Does that say Manchester on your board? Yes, it does. You're actually about to reach your destination. You know what building to my right actually kind of reminds me of? Um, it's a famous painting by a guy who's from Manchester. I can't remember his name, but basically he was known for his, uh, like, his... Not quite dystopian, but it's kind of like realist paintings of um, the Manchester area, as well as uh, his stick figure people. What's his name? I remember I actually studied him for a little bit when I was doing photography at um, college. Uh, Manchester painter stick people. As uh, that one. There we go. Um, L.S. Lowry. That's it. L.S. Lowry. Some of his paintings actually are rather good for the Manchester, the, um, this era. Well, if I actually have a look at him if you're interested. Yeah, born in Stratford, lived in Manchester. His work, something I, uh, spent a lot of time re researching back when I was at, um, college. Photography. Well, it's not too bad subject, actually. I quite enjoyed that. Though, as I say, computer science was definitely my uh, main foray into doing it. Man, those are... Uh, that project that we were doing... Long, 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 long. Anyhow, we'll start getting ready to stop the train. We've got 200 yards to go until we do that. They've got plenty of um, room for the next red signal. Throttle will actually cut now. And in a moment, we shall start pressing the brakes to bring the train to a halt. Nice and slowly, but very surely. Right, max braking now. Perfect. Alright, good work. Move these locos to one side, ready for another duty. Remember to check the junctions and set any required junctions. We'll do that from the map since we are lazy. Right, let's see where we're going to. So, you are set for straights. Then you go down, and then we need to reverse you back up to here. So, you need to be set. You are fine. You are also fine. You are fine. You are not fine. And then that one gets set after we have passed. So, throttle limp. Brakes are released. Hold the release actually. We put the throttle in again. Right, let's get going. So, cross the first set of points. Give us a bit of a gap before we start reversing into that again. We'll use a third person god mode cam to kind of watch the train pass the point. Once the last carriage is clear, we'll then be free to reverse. Should be plenty of track left to go. Yeah, it just leads into another siding really, won't cause too much of a hassle for us. That's no need. Stick on max braking anyway. Mm, maybe a bit too short, that. <laughs> Release for the brakes. And throttle goes up. Right, now we can break it. Set the points. Which is done from this lever here. And now set the reverse up to reverse. So release all the braking. Give it a few seconds to decharge all the brake pressure. 
in fact recharge it since the brakes when they're raised are being held and throttle goes up and then let's now reverse into the uh, siding here. Mid by set training to reverse but also helpful and not just let it roll into a position. Now what I'm concerned by Are we actually meant to reverse into here or? Are we just told to uncouple the train there? I don't quite understand that. Let me uncouple the load. Let's bring the train to a halt and then uncouple it. Figure out uh, where were you meant to uncouple the uh, vehicles. You go uncouple here. And stop at location. What have we done, Droya? What have you done? Um, we'll work around it. I'm going to do something stupid now. Reverse to stay in there. Reverse stays in reverse. Brake release. Can we still push those cars? Answer is no. So I may need to now go and recouple them. Under this mission. Oh, so very wrong. Oh, well done. Just duty is complete. Have we broken the mission? I mean, you're now going to roll backwards. Uh. Teleport into the seat now. Uh, set the throttle and reverse it to off. Quickly set a brake. Best will probably be the handbrake. Handbrake, maybe that brake as well. Ah, draw ya. What is wrong with you? There we go. That stops it now. Let's go secure this end. So you're off. You're now off. Turn the key. Set the brakes to shut down. And uh, climb down to complete his duty. Yes, Droya. You have officially gone and broken trends in world. Um, <laughs> what have we done? So was the mission like recouple of this train set and move it somewhere else? I don't quite know. What I do know is that that counts to the end of Northern Trans Pennine Traveller. Um, yes, of course, because it wouldn't be a train sim world mission if I actually go and break the last mission. We did it with the uh, LIRR. We did it with Great. Did we do it with Great Western? No, Great Western was almost hit by a train. I don't know. I've just got a thing about breaking these missions. But hey, we've done it, and I got 10,050 coins out of it. So, uh, yeah, that is the Northern Trans Pennine. Like I said, a bit sad that this is now the uh, last mission for it. And it has been a fun set of missions, this. It really has. I've thoroughly enjoyed these ones. So, um, it'll be nice to see what kind of, uh, what kind of British route we'll get in the future. Because, again, we all know Trenton World goes in the cycle of British... German, American, British, German, American. We've just had the German route release, pretty good, and um, American will probably be next. Though you never know, because I may break that cycle. We may get something else uh, coming soon, but we'll see. We'll see what comes in the long run. But hey, that was Dovetail Games. That was the Northern Trans Pennine Express. So, there you go, no more next mission. Probably should go back to the last checkpoint and redo this properly, but hey. Um, yeah. That is that. So, I thank you guys very much for watching. Do leave a like if you did enjoy it. Do subscribe. And we'll be back with more Train to World action in the near future. Thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye.